Harvard researchers claim to have uncovered a hidden code inside the mysterious Rongo Rongo script of Easter Island. What's inside has astronomers seriously alarmed. For over 150 years, these strange wooden tablets covered in tiny symbols have baffled every expert who tried to decode them. But now, using advanced AI pattern recognition, a team may have cracked what could be the most sophisticated astronomical calendar ever created by an ancient civilization. The code doesn't just track the moon and stars. It appears to predict celestial events with terrifying accuracy. Events that haven't happened yet. We're talking about a tiny, isolated island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. The same people who carved those massive stone heads apparently encoded cosmic knowledge that rivals our modern understanding of space. Knowledge that suggests they were watching the sky for something specific. And if these findings are correct, we may be forced to rethink what ancient civilizations knew about the universe. Because what the Rongo Rongo tablets might be warning us about is still out there, circling in the darkness above our heads. The implications are staggering. These aren't just random scratches on wood. This could be the most important archaeological discovery of the century. Here's what Harvard's team did that changed everything. They fed thousands of Rongo Rongo glyphs into the same AI pattern recognition systems we use to hunt for exoplanets in deep space. Think about it. When astronomers search telescope data for distant worlds, they're looking for tiny, repeating dips in starlight. Patterns so subtle that human eyes would never catch them. The AI scans millions of data points and finds cycles hidden in the noise. That's exactly what happened with these Easter Island tablets. The AI spotted recurring cycles in the glyph arrangements that align suspiciously well with lunar phases and equinox shifts. Patterns that repeat every 18.6 years. That's the lunar standstill cycle. But here's the mind-blowing part. The people who carved these tablets lived on a speck of land 2,300 miles from the nearest continent. No telescopes, no computers. Yet, somehow they encoded astronomical data that took us centuries to rediscover. The AI found something else. Glyph sequences that seem to track stellar drift. That's when star positions slowly shift over thousands of years due to Earth's wobbling axis. Modern astronomy only confirmed this in the last few centuries. Imagine this. A script carved into wooden tablets centuries ago, and only now, with 21st century AI, are we seeing hidden astronomical codes. It's like the past has been waiting for our technology to catch up. But what these cycles suggest goes far beyond ordinary lunar calendars. The astronomers who reviewed Harvard's preliminary findings weren't just surprised, they were genuinely alarmed. Because the patterns don't just track regular celestial events like moon phases or seasonal changes. They appear to encode warnings about rare cosmic alignments, events that happen once every few thousand years. Alignments that can trigger massive gravitational effects on Earth's crust and atmosphere. Some astronomers believe this could mean the ancient Rapa Nui were tracking something we're only now understanding, orbital resonances between planets that create cascading effects throughout the solar system, precession cycles that shouldn't have been observable without sophisticated instruments. If you love uncovering mysteries like this, hit subscribe now. We bring you these hidden discoveries every week. The most disturbing part isn't what they recorded. It's why they felt compelled to preserve it on nearly indestructible wooden tablets. Like they were leaving a message for future generations. If this is true, it isn't just fascinating, it's terrifying. Because it suggests they recorded something we may only now be rediscovering. Something that's still circling above us in the darkness. But here's the twist. The code doesn't just track the moon and planets. What Harvard's team believes they found next shocked even seasoned astronomers. This discovery puts Easter Island in the same league as history's greatest astronomical civilizations. And that should terrify us. The ancient Maya created codices that predicted solar eclipses with perfect accuracy. They calculated when the sun would go dark centuries before it happened. Babylonian priests used complex geometry to track Jupiter's motion across the sky. They knew planetary cycles that we didn't rediscover until the telescope age. Then there's the Antikythera mechanism, a bronze computer pulled from a Greek shipwreck that calculated planetary positions automatically. It was so advanced that nothing like it appeared again for over a thousand years. Think about it. If the Greeks had mechanical computers and the Babylonians calculated planetary geometry, 
Why couldn't Polynesian priests on a remote island have done something equally brilliant using their own system? But here's what makes Rongo Rongo different. Those other civilizations had contact with each other. They shared knowledge across empires and trade routes. Easter Island was completely isolated. Whatever astronomical knowledge they encoded, they developed entirely on their own. If Rongo Rongo encodes similar astronomical knowledge, it forces us to rethink Polynesian navigation and their view of the cosmos. These weren't just skilled sailors reading stars for direction. They might have been sophisticated astronomers tracking cosmic cycles that most civilizations never noticed. The implications are staggering. We're looking at a script that could rival the greatest astronomical achievements in human history, created by people we've completely underestimated. But the Harvard team suspects the glyphs might go even further, hinting at an event still in our future. Here's where this story gets genuinely unsettling. The AI patterns don't just match historical astronomical events. Some sequences seem to point toward future cycles. The code could mark eclipse cycles leading up to a major alignment in 2030. That's when a total solar eclipse path will cross directly over Easter Island, the first time in centuries that the island will experience totality. Or the glyphs might encode comet appearances, ancient warnings of celestial omens that return on thousand-year cycles, comets that our ancestors saw as harbingers of catastrophe. Think about it this way. If you knew a devastating cosmic event was coming, how would you warn future generations? You'd carve it into the most durable material you could find, You'd make it important enough that people would preserve it even if they couldn't read it. This could be why astronomers are alarmed. The code might not just describe past events. It could be predicting phenomena that haven't happened yet. Events were only now advanced enough to understand and verify. What do you think? Could an undeciphered script really warn about cosmic events centuries in advance? Let us know in the comments before we reveal the next piece because the timeline matches up in ways that are almost impossible to ignore. The glyphs seem to be counting down to something, something that's approaching fast. And just when you think this mystery can't get stranger, the context of Easter Island itself changes everything. The Easter Island mystery goes far deeper than just wooden tablets. The entire island might have been designed as a massive astronomical observatory. Those famous Moai statues aren't randomly placed. Recent satellite data and LIDAR scans reveal precise alignments. Many face specific points on the horizon where key stars rise during solstices and equinoxes. Some Moai orientations correspond to Orion's belt. Others point to where the Pleiades cluster appears during navigation season. The massive Rano Raraku quarry aligns perfectly with the Southern Cross constellation. It's almost as if the whole island was designed as a living observatory. And Rongo Rongo, the only script ever invented in Polynesia, may have been the manual. Think about it. You have nearly a thousand stone statues positioned across the landscape like cosmic markers. Then you have wooden tablets covered in astronomical codes. The statues could be the physical observatory. The tablets could be the written map of these alignments. This isn't just coincidence. The Rapa Nui people created the most sophisticated astronomical complex in the Pacific. The Moai were the hardware. Rongo Rongo was the software. And if Harvard's decoding is correct, this system was designed to track something specific, something the ancient astronomers believed was critically important to preserve for future generations. But here's the tragic part. We almost lost this knowledge forever. When European explorers first reached Easter Island in 1722, they found a thriving civilization with thousands of inhabitants. By the 1870s, the population had collapsed to just over 100 people. Slave raids carried off entire generations. Disease wiped out families. The cultural knowledge that took centuries to develop vanished in decades. Missionaries and collectors gathered up nearly every Rongorongo tablet they could find. They shipped them to museums in Europe and America. Today, only 27 tablets survive worldwide. Not a single one remains on Easter Island itself. The people who could read these scripts died before they could pass on their knowledge. No bilingual texts, no teacher-student traditions. The code was broken by tragedy, not time. We're left with about 15,000 individual glyphs spread across those surviving tablets. Previous attempts to crack the code have all failed. 
Ethnologist Thomas Barthel created sign lists in the 1950s, but couldn't prove they meant anything. Computer analysis in the 1990s found patterns but no meaning. Most scholars believe Rongorongo might be proto-writing, more like memory aids than a complete written language. The symbols could trigger oral recitations rather than spell out specific words. But that's exactly what makes Harvard's AI discovery so revolutionary. If the patterns really do encode astronomical data, it proves Rongorongo was far more sophisticated than anyone imagined. So here's what we know. Harvard's A. I uncovered recurring patterns in Rongorongo that align with astronomical cycles, patterns that suggest the ancient Rapa Nui, people possess sophisticated knowledge of cosmic events. The astronomers reviewing this data aren't just impressed, they're genuinely concerned, because some of these patterns seem to point toward rare celestial alignments that haven't happened yet, events that could occur within our lifetimes. We've seen this before. The Maya predicted eclipses centuries in advance. The Greeks built mechanical computers to track planets. Babylonian priests calculated orbital geometry without telescopes. Every time we underestimate ancient civilizations, we discover they knew far more than we gave them credit for. But Rongorongo might be different. This wasn't created by a vast empire with trade networks and shared knowledge. This came from a tiny, isolated island in the middle of nowhere. Whatever they encoded, they figured out completely on their own. The tragedy is that we almost lost it forever. European contact devastated the Rapa Nui culture. The people who could read these tablets died before passing on their knowledge. For 150 years, we've been staring at what could be humanity's most important astronomical record, unable to unlock its secrets. If Harvard's discovery is confirmed, it changes everything. Rongo Rongo isn't just random symbols or memory aids. It's a sophisticated encoding system that preserved cosmic knowledge across centuries. The whole island becomes a different story. The Moai statues aren't just ceremonial monuments. They're astronomical markers positioned to track celestial events. Rongo Rongo tablets aren't just cultural artifacts. They're the instruction manual for reading the sky. If true, Rongo Rongo isn't just a lost script. It could be humanity's forgotten message about the sky, rediscovered just in time. Think about the timing. We developed AI pattern recognition, just advanced enough to crack this code. We're approaching the same cosmic alignments the ancient Rapa Nui might have been tracking. We're finally technologically capable of understanding what they tried to preserve. Maybe that's not coincidence. Maybe that's exactly what they intended. So, what do you think? Is this the breakthrough we've been waiting for, or just another mystery carved into wood? Either way, make sure you're subscribed because the next discovery might change everything we know about our past and our future. The biggest mysteries of our universe are only just beginning to reveal themselves. Subscribe, like, and join us again. Because if ancient civilizations really did leave us warnings about the cosmos, we need to be ready to listen.